everybody, this is Rick Gamer 75 welcome back to Let's Play Minecraft MC Nostalgia. I know what you might be wondering, why haven't you been making new episodes for a while? Well, take a look behind you, because I started organising this, it's going to be my new house. So yeah, building takes a very long time and it's also because I was busy with other YouTube projects and that. Legend of Zelda, Skyward Sword, and then we're doing Lego Star Wars. But now, I'm finally back to Minecraft. And to be honest, I really miss playing it. So let's do some more. We are still in 1.0.0. We're going to do four more episodes, including this one in this version and then we're going to move on to the next because now each update is going to be five episodes but can you guess what update we're going on next if you reckon 1.1 you're incorrect because we're doing snapshots as well I think the first snapshot we're going to be doing is 11w478 the first snapshot for 1.1 and snapshots will only be done with three episodes you know similar to early MC Nostalgia however if the snapshot happens to be very unstable which can crash very easily you know, I'm only going to use it for two episodes we're going to try and use every snapshot I know I skipped 1.8 for at least one and two but I've got to change the part of this, of you know, snapshots now. I did use all 1.9 pre releases and uh, release candidates, but that's besides the point. Mm. I don't have any torches. We're going to continue constructing some of the house on screen this episode. I have not placed torches down yet. That's a lot of leaf blocks. <laughs> Creeper. Gotcha. At least I killed it before it exploded, at least. Skeleton. Ouch, you got me. Okay, I'm ready to take you out now. It gets really hard to kill skeletons once we get up to 1.5. But I forgot which snapshot of 1.5 introduced that in. So until we get up to that snapshot, we won't have to worry about skeletons. Because when we get up to that snapshot, and even in the current version, it's still like that. It's... Skeletons will rapid shoot ya. The more close you are, the more likely the faster that they'll shoot their arrows. Why else that light up? That. Light that up. Light that. And over here. Seeing that though, the torch shouldn't be there. Because that's where the wall's gonna be. Same thing with the torch over here. We're gonna construct a little bit more of the house today. 
24 lily pads. Why am I even picking up lily pads? Oh, it doesn't matter. You know what? We also need a furnace. Plop it in. We might smelt the iron now. An axe. Yes, an axe. Hmm, we need some more iron. <laughs> Cut this tree down. Until morning. Oh, the moon's seeing right now. Once this happens, we'll have no problem going to, you know, get some material. Wait, back at my old base, there should be lots of wood, but that doesn't matter. We'll, keep, we'll keep the country down. We'll still go back to the old base to get materials, but we're going to be staying here for a while. It's like a new, another era of MC Nostalgia. It's the sun's coming up. Nine saplings. Another sure is cane farm. Right here. Yeah, sure cane tends to grow faster on sand than it does on grass. That's why I place it on sand. Although in the older versions of MC Nostalgia, you couldn't put sugar cane on sand at all. You can only put it on grass. But they've changed that. They've changed it in 1.8, I think? Might be 1.7 or 1.6. Can't quite remember. I'm gonna have to look it up after this video on the wiki. So yeah. Just you know, after nearly 100 episodes, we are finally back to the skin that I'm most familiar with. Mario. We can keep using this skin for a while. Hopefully forever. Unless if an, another event happens and it causes me to, ch to change appearance again. Hmm. Unless if someone wants to sneak up on me and... and cause me to regenerate. Except when you eat a golden apple, this time, it allows me to change my appearance of choice, and I let it allows me to choose my next appearance, and it will turn me into that. Except with regenerations, I've got no choice. And one more thing is. The only reason why when I ate the gone apple caused my outfit to come back as well is because of the skin change curse. But regenerations only affect the body, not the outfit. So 
any golden apples I'll eat now, but will only change my body appearance. And I've got to change the outfit manually. I'm gonna cut this tree down too. Back in the day, everyone loved Minecraft, back in the day, but n sadly nowadays, they move on to more other games, like PUBG, Fortnite, other stuff. But, but I still love Minecraft, you know. I'm going to continue making Minecraft videos because I just love this game so much. Because I, I completely respect this as an important game in the industry. But, it's the most popular sandbox game. I know there's other games I can play as well, but I do do other games. Stuff that I grew up with, you know? Let's cut some more trees down. For example, I don't really like Call of Duty that much. No, I don't really like that game at all. Because that game is like very linear. Where you gotta keep doing missions from A to B where there's, you know... Just keep shooting stuff and that where there's no exploration, no side quests, nothing. I know Mario's the same as well, but at least Nintendo does make a few different stuff like new power-ups and all that. But Call of Duty, it's just the same old game every time. It's just Trust me, I have played it before, but playing online, I played it for like five minutes and then I stopped. Because there's too much little kids on there. Yes, I know Minecraft had, might have little kids too, but... At least Minecraft doesn't have microphone ch chat in that. Or card does, so I have to put up with it. All the time. Besides, the game is like rated M. Kids shouldn't be playing that. The parents really need to take a look at, you know, the ratings. Well, in a week from when this is recorded, E3 2018 is going to happen, and Nintendo's once again going to, like I mentioned in a Zelda video, going to show off Super Smash Brothers. 
and I made a video any one of my other Zelda videos I mentioned what characters I want slash don't want and I could see which characters could come to smash in that and once E3 comes I'll tell you what it got right and what it got wrong Because I'm very curious to see what characters are going to be in it, you know? Okay, let's start building some more. Now, these sides here, I want some windows. So we'll go and build some of this. Build the walls. Whoops. Okay, let's go. So here's some questions of MC Nostalgia like what's your favorite episode? What's your favorite season? What's my favorite skin I've used in the series? And what's my favorite intro? Alright, I'm gonna get off. My favorite episode out of all of them, I would have to pick the very first one because that's the one that started it all. What's my favorite season? Um, despite episode one being my favorite episode, my favorite season is actually not season one. It would have to be either season three, four, five, or ten. Because, you know, that's the ones where I put the most effort into my episodes, you know? It's not going to be a window here might be a small window here small window here build a window here and here you can tell it's the same well because you can see the glass up there Here is where the window is going to be. Wait, he, oh wait, the other question is, what's my favorite skin? Mario, duh. Because he's my favorite. And other questions might be like, what's my favorite intro? Mm, I'm going to have to go with the s intro used from episode 51 to 93. Where we fly to Earth, then we go to the Vortex. My logo pops up, and then whatever character I'm using and then Minecraft MC Nostalgia what skin I'm currently in what season I'm currently in I meant so yeah that's my favourite intro I mean I do like the intro useful season 6 to 8 where it has Red Gamer 75 in the font of Mario floating through space but now that I think about it I don't 
I kind of think the intro I use for season 9 slash 10 and the intro you use for season 11 kind of suck because they're a bit too long. Because the intro I use for season 9 and 10, all it is is it's just a camera flowing around the earth. And it's a bit too long. Oh, the skeleton. In season 11, it's just flying through a vortex for like nearly two minutes. Although at the start it did have montages from the previous 10 seasons, that would be cool. And I'm actually glad that I shortened the intro for the movie. And the intro I'm using right now, I'm not really enjoying it as well. In a few more episodes I might drop it. And go for something a bit more basic because I'm starting to think the Doctor Who style intros getting a little bit old. I might go for something more basic. Similar to episodes 1 to 50, but it will actually have animation. So yeah, after episode 155, I'll drop this Doctor Who intro. And I'll try something new. So I want you to put... So I'll only remove it if um you vote. I want people to vote. A. Keep the Doctor intro. Or B. Try something new and basic. I'm going to ask all my friends what they want. Whoever votes wins. I'll tell you all by the next episode. Cut this down. I might do a little bit more of the house off screen. No. We'll do that. Over there. My axe is starting to run out. This next episode will start to do the windows. In episode 4, we'll start doing the roof, and hopefully, by the end of episode 5, we'll be all done. What kind of bug is that? There's a skeleton on the roof. I'll take care of him. Oh, I killed him. Hmm. I wasn't meaning to, but still a win for me. There's not going to be a window on the deck here, like I said before. Here we are. Although the events, the crazy stuff that happened in MC Nostalgia, those will still happen. But they'll only happen when I'm cl actually close to an actual update. In Season 12, well, I'm starting, starting to keep the episodes at Season 12, you know?
iron ingot. You know what? We'll make a shelf for the next episode. Alright, that's it. This is Red Gamer 75 sign off. Thanks for watching. See you again in the next one. Peace out. Oh.